Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. We begin tonight with controversy in Crook County. The library is under pressure about the placement of books with LGBTQ themes. Today, Bola Batabo talked with the library director. They're too graphic and too borderline pornography, child pornography. LGBTQ related books have been a point of contention at the Crook County Library. The concern is from some folks who feel that exposing their children to materials with LGBTQ materials goes against their own family values. Several Crook County residents voiced at a series of library board meetings. They want LGBTQ books labeled and removed from the children's section. The hips on the drag queen go swish, swish, swish. So those of you that might not know the song, it's from the wheels on the bus go round and round. To put a book into a children's area that has to do with drag queens singing a song we sing to babies, that is wrong. Amen. Crook County Library Director April Wittaveen says there's a greater message to get across. The beauty of public libraries is the diversity of materials that we provide. Wittaveen says what the community members are asking violates library procedures. The situation with this and why it is an issue of censorship and intellectual freedom is because it is coming from this warning perspective. Several complaints started filing in during spring when elementary schools would come to visit the library. And at a certain point, one of the children um, brought home a book that they had checked out that their parent didn't agree with. Wittaveen says the problem with adhering to a specialized bookshelf request can also lead to the further stigmatization of the LGBTQ community. We did a survey um, through some of our channels to reach the LGBTQ community here, and it actually would be um, less safe for them to access these books um, than if they were just interfiled the way that they traditionally are. It's becoming increasingly clear to me that these community members do not understand not only the difference between gender and sexuality, but the developmental stages of children. You know what would have and still could help with that? Some diverse books. With LGBTQ books all being in a specialized section, people can't remain anonymous. Other risks include a contract termination with the Deschutes Library, a major loss in funding, and losing their standing as a recognized public library in Oregon. The library's county budget would have to absorb the costs. Wittaveen is resigning from her position as director to take on the position of library director at OSU Cascades, and in part due to the emotional stress of the controversy. Well, deny that this has been a very difficult part of my life and it has impacted my work-life balance. The board has a meeting Thursday discussing two proposals. One outlines what it would take to make the designated shelf and the other is for maintaining the status quo. With parental rights being a big part of the procedure, Wittaveen said they would better educate parents on what it means to get their child a library card. Bola Batibo, News Channel 21.